y'all it's molly and welcome back to my channel in today's video we are going to start our spring cleaning so first i'm going to get all the valentine's decor that i have up here in the entertainment center out of here and i'm going to add some plants <laughs> and I've got a new plant stand from Yasonic. So thank you so much to Yasonic for sponsoring today's video. I am so excited to unbox that. So I got some new plants here. I got this Monstera and I also got this, it's called a ponytail palm. So I got this as well. And we're going to put those in on a plant stand and kind of freshen up the living room. So let's get to cleaning. I want to say hello and I hope you are all having a great weekend so far. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I am so happy to have you here. My name is Molly and I'm a mom of two kiddos ages six and three. I love to make cleaning videos to help get you motivated. So I am hoping that this spring clean and decorate will do just that for you. For the decorating in today's video, I'll be using mainly plants. I have become a huge plant lover within the past year. Just give me all the plants. <laughs> I'm slowly adding more and more to our home and I'm in love with them. I can't believe I have not bought myself a watering can yet. <laughs> I really need to do that. This right here is a pothos that my husband's cousin actually gave to me for a Christmas and it sprouted roots so I know it's time to pot it. It actually sprouted roots a while ago and I've just been waiting for this video to pot it. I got this cute little planter from Home Depot and it is in my favorite color that I love to decorate with which is like a sea green color. Now I'm going to unbox and get this new plant stand all set up to start off the spring decorating. I'm going to put my new Monstera on this and another pothos plant that I bought for myself for my birthday last year. So I want to say thank you to Yasonic for sponsoring this portion of today's video. I'm excited to partner up with them again. And this is their brand new plant stand that they just added to Amazon. So I will have it linked below for you in the description box if you're interested in it. It comes with two round stands that connect with each other. There are instructions that come with it that are easy to follow. Plus they give you a hex screw and wrench to help tighten all the nuts and bolts. There are three poles that you connect the bottom one to first, and then you connect them to three more poles before adding the top portion to it. So, and you can see that they, they slide right into a good little space there. You'll know exactly where to line them up to. So, but this is made up of some very good quality metal that I can tell. So you can put this on your porch outside if you wanted to as well, or have it in your home like I'm doing. And it has this very cute little decorative bird element to it, which I thought was super cute and perfect for springtime. But I'm going to get all of these pieces connected together now, and then we will be ready to start decorating. I wanted to show you guys that it has kind of a curved element to it here in between both of the stands where you put the plants. And I wanted to show you where you're gonna line up the poles with the top portion here. And you just put the screws and the bolts in there and then you are done. <laughs>
now we're gonna continue the decorating portion and decorate this entertainment center that I got from Hobby Lobby recently. And I've got this candle that I got from Bath and Body Works that I thought would work really well for the springtime. And I found this cute little white colancho plant at the grocery store. <laughs> And I have this cute bless our nest sign that my friend who owns Fernet Farmhouse, she made this for me several years ago. <laughs> Time to continue this cleaning portion for the spring clean. I'm going to hit up all the windows and the window sills in the living room area. And I do have the windows kind of blurred out here for my neighbor's privacy. Try think that it's time you let that spark out. You've been hiding in the shadows way too long. is helping me by moving the couch so I can clean underneath of it because it has not been cleaned in so long and we all know that it gets really gross under there. I wanted to show you guys how gross it is under here. So I'm gonna sweep everything up first and then I'm going to get it with the wet Swiffer after that. right here i was teasing my husband i was like you really want to sit there you're gonna just be sitting there 
in my video <laughs> just sitting there <laughs> but uh but no he he helped me he helped me get all of the move the couch for me and all of that so i got his lovely muscles his man muscles <laughs> there to help me out so no worries but i i found some gross stuff here on the wall so i just put some warm water on this rag and just kind of wiped it down and it seemed to work really well and there's some other spots around our house that the kids have gotten all nasty and dirty on the walls. So I'm going to try the same thing probably in a later video if I get to that in my spring cleaning. We'll see. But they need to be cleaned as well. <laughs> Just so much stuff on the walls. We're going to move the couch back. Or well, my husband's going to move the couch back. And then I am going to get to cleaning all of the baseboards around the, the living room. So you can probably tell that this is later in the day, it's the same day, it's in the afternoon. I did all the plant stuff, like the decorating with the plants earlier that morning. And then we had to take our daughter to soccer, even though she's not really into it, which is okay. But we got the, the afternoon sunlight here, which I just love the late afternoon sunlight in this room. It is just gorgeous. I know I've said that before. <laughs> it's just one of my favorite things about this house. And I found myself just coming into the living room and just looking at the entertainment center with the plants and that new plant stand. And I was just in love with it. I love it so much. Well, that is the end of today's video for the first spring clean and decorate with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope it gave you motivation to start your spring cleaning. If you made it this far in the video, comment down below and tell me, have you started spring cleaning your house yet? <laughs> well, please like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.